seamless transition. So I just had my soup, and I'm going to try and land in that little gulf there with this ship. I've probably told you that a billion times by now. I'm on the other side of the earth from it, but I should plummet down there right quite nicely. Um, speaking of which, I'm just going to get rid of my lander stage because I no longer need it. Is that wise? Because I might need it if I want to make any last minute adjustments to my landing if I somehow start coming down on the land which I'm actually headed towards. Because if you look at it, I'm actually headed towards that. I mean, I'll, nah. No, well, there is actually that little jut out which I'll probably hit. But you know what? Screw it. Hell yeah, I did it. I did it. Y'all saw me. Y'all saw me. I did it. Who done it? Charlie done it. Prematurely activate the parachute so that if something goes wrong, it'll still activate. Um. And. I'm gonna go back to this and speed up time. Do 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 We're gonna be landing on the nighttime side of the earth. Just like let me check. Yeah, yeah, it looks like we are. Uh-huh. We're just coming out of the nighttime side, as a matter of fact. We're traveling into the daylight. As we speak. Actually, wait a second, which way are we traveling? Oh, we're traveling that way, in which case we're coming in. Oh, I thought we were... Oh. Oh, we're going this way. Oh, we're going this way. I see. I'm stupid. I'm really stupid. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Oh, okay. Looks like we're going to land r nice and near our um, launch pad. Uh, those are our three little things that hold us together before the launch. We're going to be landing right near our launch pad if we don't land on the land. Uh, and we're going to be doing it at night. So, yeah, lol, didn't notice that. Ah, that's kind of funny how I didn't notice that at all. Which piece of land is that that we're flying over as we speak? Ah, oh, yes, the Gulf of South Curb Curbfrica. No, um, South Camerica, I think. Yeah, and that's sort of like Indonesia. I uh, I don't know, South Camerica. Yeah, we're just going to call it South America. Screw you, that's what we're calling it. South America. Very southern tip of it. I actually don't know if this is south. I hope it is. Uh, it's not actually the southern tip. There's New Zealand. Kicking, a bit, kicking around. France. Don't know why it's France, but it is. It's France. Deal with it. Oh, our blue line. Oh, our blue line is so going to land. Oh, no. Oh, dear Lord. Oh, we're in the atmosphere. Oh, dear Lord. This can only go poorly for our poor Kerbonaut. Okay, we're landing on land, folks. <laughs> or so it appears. In fact, we're about to be landing in land, on land in five, four, three, two, never, maybe we should start the countdown from seven, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yes, we are now landing on land. And I've ejected my rocket, so I have no way of correcting this because I'm so clever. <clears throat> oh, well, at least it's just a short, short car ride from watch from launch base. Launch base. What? Anyway, it's in the same country, I think. I don't know, maybe this is like South South Africa, and this is just like another state. You know, this is just another state. 
ugly. No, but that is, I mean, that is like totally Europe. I mean, that's, that's, that's Crusher. That's, uh, that's in England. But that pit's gonna, you know, disperse and turn this into an island. Whoa, whoa, our blue line is, is moving. I think we actually might come down in this water. Too late for us to come down on, on the land. So, yeah, I think that's what's gonna happen. Oh, water textures are loading. You know what that means, guys. When the water textures load, ho oh ho, that's when you know you're screwed. Them water textures, they're loading, you're close to the, to the earth. Oh, parachute deploy. Man, are we going like, we're going almost on the horizon. That's sort of epic. That is a bit epic. Whoa, is that, what's that? Oh, that's our uh, other thing. Which is now shooting away from us incredibly quickly. Probably because we have the parachute, actually, and it doesn't have a parachute. Because we are boss, and it is not boss. Bloosh. Yeah, that's what happens when you don't get a parachute. Mm hmm. Oh, we're moving alarmingly quickly. Mm. Throttle up, throttle up, do a retro burn. Lol, no. Yeah. Okay, I sort of don't like this. But well, we're 10 kilometers in the air. It's not, not a problem. No problem. Anyway, as soon as both the, both the retro burn mark and our, like, facing mark are on the north mark, the, the, the very center bit, or, you know, the bit mark the thingy here in the middle, that we're about to reach, But, uh, oh, water textures are actually getting kind of detailed and coming in. It's being hot. 140 meters per second. And now we're, now we're actually only, uh, three kilometers from the earth. Well, the ten before, now we're two and a half kilometers from the earth. And my parachute doesn't even want to expand. Two kilometers over the earth? No. One and a half kilometers over the Earth, and almost one kilometer over the Earth. Yes, one kilometer over the Earth. Should expand to 600, I heard. 500, okay. We can expand it to 400, that's cool. We're moving nice and slowly now. So we should just come down for a nice wet landing with Bill Kerman. And all should be well. One hopes. One hopes. And we landed at night, not too far away from our continent. Uh, I might just quickly tab out, because we're 300 meters away. Yeah, not that far. They could just take a car and then a speedboat from, we'll call that Curb, Curb Bay, Curb Point. They're like, um, I, I don't know, uh, Jebediah Point, that's what we're going to call it, Jebediah Point. Like it or not, that's what we're calling that little point that they're going to take the speedboat from to rescue Bill Carmen, Jebediah Point. Because that's where his rocket parts and speedboat emporium is on Jebediah Point. And so we're about to come down here in 30 meters, 20 meters, 10 meters, and splash down. And do a bit of bubbly. Auto save. And we're not tipping over. Oh. Sploosh. Not as amusing as it is normally. Anyway, so with that, I think we can conclude whatever episode this is. I'm not really keeping track. This could be anything from 7 to 8 to 6 to probably, it's actually definitely not 6. Could be seven. Could be seven. I hope it's seven. Because, uh, yeah. Uh, well, whatever episode this is, au revoir, and I will see you next time.